All right, as I'm sure most of you know, well, first of all, welcome to my mom's bathroom. Awesome. You'll probably hear uh, Courtney in the background, if not see her sneak peek cameos. There's my sister. Uh, as you can tell from my videos, I don't, uh, I don't wear makeup like ever, ever. Maybe once every six months for like a special occasion, and I only know how to do my makeup one way, and that's the way I've been doing it since I was probably in sixth grade. So not a whole lot has changed. Maybe the colors a little bit, you know. Uh, I don't wear the blue eyeliner anymore, uh, as it was hip in sixth grade. But uh, that's it. I, yeah, I don't do the makeup thing. So I am going to attempt using WikiHow because that's how I live my life. Is Google it, and WikiHow tells me what to do. I'm gonna try to contour my face and I can't even keep a straight face talking about it. Um, so apparently you're supposed to start with foundation that's your color and I think my sister's dark color is probably my color because I'm a little darker than her. Oh, and she's pointing at a blender like I know how to use that. And this is, see, this is how I do it. I just put it on with my finger. I'm probably gonna speed this up so that you don't have to watch the boring parts. We're just gonna let Tiffany try to fix it itself for herself. And then uh, there's a Shelby sneaking in here, which is totally fine if she wants to be in here too, which is the other sister, the baby. So yeah, we're gonna put the foundation that's my color, maybe, everywhere. I don't know. This might turn out fantastic, and maybe I'll love it and do it every day. But, uh, <laughs> my sisters would love that because I don't, uh, I like to sleep, see, and if I sleep, then mm, there's 15 minutes that I could sleep or I could like put makeup on, which I think takes most people more than 15 minutes. All right, so I got the regular makeup. Let's see, Wiggy How To then says, get a foundation a few shades lighter than your skin. Okay, well that's probably Courtney's regular color because yeah, make sure they don't match. You can use a light concealer or eyeshadow in place of foundation. Okay, Wiki, no one cares. What am I supposed to do with this light foundation? For your highlight product. Okay, I've got that. Choose your foundation. Wait, it skips steps. <laughs> For your highlighting product. Okay. Choose a foundation a few shades darker than your skin. Okay, we'll probably use one of these insane palettes that my sister has going on over here. I don't know. Look at, look at like, why do you... Why? What is the... It's, there's so many! <laughs> Why? Why do you need all of this, girls? Why? It's just to confuse me and make things complicated. Okay, that's probably darker than me, but probably too dark, but uh, let's see. Shelby's been trying to help, but she's not supposed to. The challenge is to let my ass try to do this my damn self. And it's gonna, that's a lot of color. We're gonna go with that one. Naked looks good. This naked one looks darker than me. Probably too dark, but who fucking knows. I said the F-bomb and I apologize. Okay, now I've got the two shades of foundation. What am I supposed to do? Get a good blending brush. There's 17 brushes on the counter. I don't, like, maybe one of these? What if I ruin your brushes? You're gonna hate me forever. Um, Sure, we're gonna go with this one. It's probably not right, but this is the one we're gonna go with. Now I've got a good blending brush. What do I do now? Since your face will be wearing several different shades, it's important to get a good blending brush. Okay, thanks, internet. If you don't have a blending brush, okay, can you just tell me what the hell I'm supposed to do? All right, it's better if you pull your hair away from your face. That is done, daily look. Um, contour your face, makeup, reaches, okay, shut up, hairline, no one cares, prep your face. Didn't we already prep my face? I thought that was step one. Uh, when you contour your face, okay, no one cares. I'm not exfoliating, shut up. Um, apply foundation to your regular skin tone. Didn't we already do that? Wasn't that step one? Okay, here we go, light foundation. We're finally at the next step, 17 steps later. Apply the light foundation. Okay, you're gonna apply in, wow, this is really complex, seriously? The center of your forehead, got it, I know how to do that. So we're gonna put some on this. That's the light color, yeah, this looks delayed as shit. I don't know what I'm doing. The center of my forehead, that looks about center in my little lines here. My sisters are probably dying next to me. Along the top of your brow, why didn't they just say your forehead from your brow to the center of your brow? That would, feels like that would be easier. Okay. I'm gonna ruin Courtney's makeup. 
I'm gonna over all kinds of things. You can laugh, it's okay. <laughs> They're dying. Along the bridge of your nose. I know what that is. Okay, I think that's a lot, but you know, who knows. On the apples of your cheeks. What the fuck is an apple of your cheek? These, I don't see fruit. Do you guys see fruit? I don't see fruit. I think you're supposed to like, I don't know, like this, I think. Yeah. On your cupid's bow. Who wrote this? <laughs> Yeah. No, what the hell is a cupid's bow? I feel like I'm just like, I think you go in the circles. I'm pretty sure we're just gonna go with what I think face contouring is at this point because why not? And then I think you do like here, you make the jawline thing, I think. And then you're supposed to do the, like the T or something. This looks, be do I not, do I look beautiful internet? Am I beautiful? <laughs> you can probably hear them giggling in the background because they're dying. Uh, to the center of your chin. Oh my god. Really? Oh look, there's pictures. That would have been helpful earlier. Um, yeah. She pretty much did what I did. Pretty much. Okay. Center of your, just like here? And find your cupid's bow too. I don't know what the hell a cupid's bow is. <laughs> We're just gonna keep mm -hmm. uh, circles under the eyeball. Yeah, it's really it's really helping my beauty. I feel gorgeous. All right, I think. Oh wait, you're supposed to do. Oh, the section. It tells me what your cupid's bow. If I would have kept reading, the section between your the tip of your nose and the top of your lip. Why don't they call that the section between the tip of your nose and your lip? I think like this. I don't know. <laughs> just, just the middle. They know I'm doing it way wrong, so they're giggling. But it's okay. It'll, it'll all blend, right? That's what you do with the sponge things. You blend it all together. All right. And then we go with a darker color. When, am I going to ruin it if I just no. use this and this? I'll okay. We're going to go with the naked in this. I believe it's called a palette. <laughs> And we're gonna put that, we're gonna give myself the, the chiseled cheekbone. This isn't working. Maybe I need darker. <laughs> Courtney's suggesting that I use this one, so I'm gonna try. These all have fancy names like Sephora on them and Naked, <laughs> places that I've never ever stepped foot in and probably never will. Yeah, I look, I look sexy. Let me just say that the sex appeal is just, it's just oozing, oozing off of me. Okay, so, <laughs> and then apparently you're supposed to do it on your top of your forehead. Why? On your forehead? What is with make it look smaller? Because, yeah, okay. We all have a Tyra five head, so apparently we need to make our forehead look smaller. <laughs> and then I did the forehead, apply darker foundation to help. Right under your hairline, on the right side, blah, blah, blah. Apparently here too, apparently. I don't know. We're just going with stuff. Right, we're going to blend it all, right? It's, the blender apparently makes this all, this insanity look magical. I could never be a drag queen as much as I want to. <laughs> oh, yeah, and then the nose. That's what the drag queens do is the nose. Also, I'm using my phone camera as my mirror because why not? I don't think this is going to make my nose look any smaller than it already is ginormous, so. <laughs> um, and then like the tip I think you're supposed to do. I don't know, I'm making shit up now. <laughs> Along the hollows of your cheeks. Suck them in. I did that already. Gave myself the killer jaw bones, right? Probably need to do more. I'm probably not doing enough. Yeah, this is fantastical. Blend your makeup well. I know what that's. This is this thing. This because I watch Graveyard Girl, so I know what a blender is. It's the only reason I know what a blender is. And Jenna Marbles because they use these things. I think Jillian once ate one. Um, he did. <laughs> so now. Take care not to spread too much color around. Use your fingers or a foundation brush to blend the colors 
for a natural finish. Yeah, that's gonna it's gonna look natural, I'm sure. Am I just supposed to hit it? Smack myself in the face with it? Smack in your face. <laughs> Smack in. Yeah, I'm sure my, my nose looks great already. It's just fantastical. It just looks like a bunch of different colors on my head. On my white mustache that I somehow gave myself. Did you dampen it? Oh. <laughs> oh, am I supposed to wet this or something? <laughs> I don't know things. Okay, so mm. eh. Blending, blending to the gods. This doesn't look any different at all. This is a lot of work for a whole lot of not looking different. I mean, I guess I got a little cheekbone definition now going on. Um, step three, finish the look. Consider adding highlighter. Oh dear God, there's more. Um, highlighter. I think she probably has something that's supposed to be a highlighter. I'm assuming because there's a shit ton of makeup. What is this? I don't even know. It looks like it's in another language. Maybelline, Ebony Black. Doesn't tell me what it's for. Probably some sort of an eyeliner. Maybe for your brow. I don't do things. Mm. It just tells me the brand name. You know what would be helpful, makeup brands? If instead of just saying Maybelline New York on them, you said Maybelline New York, put it here. Use it for this. That would be super helpful to girls like me who don't do this very often. You know. See, uh, look at, they did the same. Oh, look, Sephora's got a cheat on the back. Thanks, Sephora. <laughs> I appreciate you. I don't, I still don't know what this is. Color illuminator, I'm assuming. Oh, look, that's not the English side. That's the problem. Brightener. So I'm assuming that I apply this to where it's still not helpful. It really isn't. I mean, what can you see? Focus on this. Can you see? You can't see it, but it's still not very helpful. At all. Blush, brightener, bronzer. It just says I'm supposed to put this on my eyes and I'm not ready to do my eyes yet. I'm assuming this is the whitener maybe? I don't know. Let's get another brush and do stuff. Um, we'll use, maybe, maybe we should have used that one earlier. Adding highlighter. Oh, under your eyeballs. We're going to use this pink color. It's probably not the right one. And this is the face I make. I think all girls make that face when they do their eyes. It's, I don't feel like this is helping at all. <laughs> Courtney just crossed herself because I am sacrilege. My, both of my sisters are into this and I have no clue what I'm doing. We might try a smoky eye in a minute too. That'll be fun. It'll be hilariously fun. Um, I guess that's what I'm supposed to do with this. Cream colors, slightly catching. Apply in the same place as you apply the lighter foundation. Really? Why then? Why don't we do that first? I feel like this is dumb. Mm hmm. Sure. Right a little here. We're gonna have to blend this shit again. Oh God. Yeah, this isn't doing anything for me. <laughs> because I'm not doing it right. Um, all right, sure. Well, I think that we'll call that highlighter. Apply blush. I think you need a big brush for blush. I don't know why, but I feel like this is the big brush and there's this pink shit on this one. So I'm just gonna go with this. Probably not right, but we're gonna go with it. Courtney's poor heart is breaking. <laughs> uh, apply brush. If you feel your face looks a little more now. <laughs> Thanks, Wiki How To. I uh, now feel really great about myself. <laughs> Apply a small amount of blush to the apples again with the apples of your cheek. Be sure to blend the blush well with the other face products. Okay, well, we're gonna go here ish. Sure. Here ish. I don't think I'm doing anything. Mm -mm. Um, we'll use it. It said blend, so I'm gonna use this because I don't know what that's for. It's a blender. 
but I don't know how to use it or apparently you're supposed to make it wet. I don't know. Yes, I said make it wet. <laughs> That's what she said. Um, consider using a matte setting powder for the love of God. We're not done, apparently. <laughs> Photo ready. That There's not a lot in that, so I'm gonna not mess with that. And seven years back. Now. All right, so I completely broke my mom's mirror. Awesome, good job me. See, this is why I don't do makeup, because things break and um, children cry and it's not, it's not pretty. This is my mom's grandma's mirror that I broke. I just want to uh, point out how awful of a daughter I am on Mother's Day, breaking my mom's mirror. Um, I think we're gonna, I, this is probably not finishing powder. I don't know, we're gonna try it. Um, I'm gonna not look at my sisters because their facial expressions are going to tell all. <laughs> and we have kids running around the house because we all have boys. So they're all running around the house. That's hence the bathroom setting. Um, we're gonna just do, oh, that is nice and white. Just like me. <laughs> nice and white. <laughs> we're gonna call this the setting powder. Probably not right. It works. All right, and then, okay. And it says I did the blush and then the setting powder. That's what we're on. And I'm not doing shimmer. It's not happening. No. Um, save your eyes and lips for last. So we're going to try to do a smoky eye. So we're going to save that for last. And then finished, it says on Wiki How To. Am I beautiful yet? I don't know. All right, so um, she's got lip steps. So we're just going to go with this one because it's... Just look at all this. Look at why do you need so many? Like, <laughs> um, I mean, I guess the darkest. I like dark lips, and this is way too pink, and this is way too pink, and this isn't even freaking a solid color. So I guess we'll go with raspberry, even though I feel like it's not my color at all. Apparently. That's what Courtney's wearing, apparently. I don't know. We'll go with it. Yeah, that, see, that's not working. I'm probably supposed to, I think you're supposed to like line your lips or something. Why does this tingle? <laughs> what the hell? My lips are burning. It's an hashtag Katie from Lip Sends. <laughs> Why are my Shout lips out. burning? <laughs> plumper. Is this supposed to, it's a plumper? Oh. No, it's not. It's Why? supposed to burn. Why? It's just supposed to. Why? What is the purpose of makeup that hurts? Because it stays on all day. No! My makeup doesn't burn and it stays on all day. There is no... It's probably a plumper. Guys! This does not feel good. I'm sorry, Katie from Lipsense, but I will never be purchasing your product because of how? Mother of Pearl. Why am I still doing it? That's the worst part. Well, I don't know things. <laughs> it's not gonna be better. Is it? Well? No, it's. Oh, mother, mother, sister, brother, this hurts. Oh, I'm gonna have to edit out the f bombs I dropped earlier. I apologize. No, it still burns. Let me see it when you're done. You gotta keep your lips open. I still don't feel good. I don't know. never. I don't like it. It doesn't. <laughs> Who does this? All right, I'm gonna pause it for a second and I'm gonna find a wiki how to on how to make a smoky eye. I'll be right back. All right, my lips are still burning. Um, I don't. And it says you're supposed to put three to five shades. I'm not, no, mm -mm, it's not happening. So one, one, like once over, that's all that the lip sense gets for me because um, yes, beauty is pain, but I don't need to be that pretty. I'm already pretty enough. So um, now we're gonna try to do a smoky eye and I figured the darker the colors, the better this is gonna look. So um, also got a, a wiki how to on how to create a classic smoky eye look. So we're gonna go with that. And the first thing it says is to apply your highlighter, but because I'm going with really dark looks, my highlighter is gonna be this like gray color. It's called Amour or Armor, I'm not sure. I don't know, makeups are weird. Um, 
So yeah, we're gonna do that, and we're gonna go and it says in the like corner of your eyeball. Okay, really gonna need a mirror for this one. I broke my mom's, so I guess I'll use the palette. So in the corner of your eyeball, you're supposed to do your light color, and then I guess I'll do both of them at the same time because yeah, it's probably the best way. So I did the corner of my eyeball, and then apparently you're supposed to put a little up here. Yeah, that's sexy. I like my full eyebrows. Yeah, all the way out apparently you're supposed to go. It's alright. I'm not paying attention to my sister's faces in the background, so you can leave a comment if they make some awesome faces in the background. <laughs> alright, so that's what it says for step one. Uh, using your eyeshadow dab, brush dab on the inside corner of your eyelid and upper, yeah, okay, good, we started. Put a medium shade in the middle of your eyeball. So we're gonna go with this like slanted color, that's appropriate. In the middle of your eyeball. That is the middle of my eyeball, I'm assuming. By my sister's giggles, apparently it's not, or I'm not doing a very good job, or both. Am I pretty yet? <laughs> okay, apply it upwards. Oh, I didn't do that. <laughs> uh, to the natural crease of your lid. Oh, I'm totally not. Oh no, that's, that's the next step I'm looking at. I'm supposed to go all the way across? I didn't do that. Or did I? I don't know. Not sure. That one looks right. Oh, this is sexy. Oh, my milkshake's gonna bring all the boys to the yard later. <laughs> Begin adding your darkest color. Begin at the outside corner of your eye and sweep into a C shape. It's a backward C that I just did, but you didn't know that because it looked right to you. Um, from, okay, we're just gonna do what she's doing in this picture. And we're gonna use Black Market, yes where I get all my goods. Um, nice and black like my heart. All right, so a C shape. This looks amazing already. <laughs> Sorry. It's oh. amazing. You shut your mouth. It's beautiful. I am beautiful. <laughs> I'm doing what she's doing on the website picture. That is a very V looking C, but you know. Yes, bitch! <laughs> <laughs> the darkest part should always be back. Looks like you smoke Apply the shadow too far in. Well, thanks for that handy tip. <laughs> <laughs> to add a dramatic classic look, sweep for your dark eyeshadow point more like a V. Okay, that's good. This one's a V and this one's a C, so I'm doing it right, just different on both sides. Sweep into the corner of your eye. Blend your shadow. Yeah, that's good. Do I use the big chunky blender for that? Because that'd be awesome. <laughs> I feel like there's not enough of it. I don't know, but am I, what, I supposed to hit myself in the eye with this thing? <laughs> <laughs> or is that but we're just gonna use the big brush and blend that. Blend, <laughs> blend the smoky eye. See, one thing they don't have to worry about with me is me stealing their makeup shit. It's never gonna happen. I mean, it's. <laughs> I can't think of words. It's beautiful. I'm so pretty. <laughs> I mean, blending it is actually not that terrible, but I feel like I'm still missing stuff. Okay, it's, I mean. Is it that bad? <laughs> Alright, so I blended my shadow. The brush she uses is a lot smaller than the brush that I use. <laughs> eh. <laughs> it's 
starting with your lightest color. I it just blended. My eye was as big as the brush. Oh, eyeliner, you devil. Um, I add eyeliner. I think I know how to do eyeliner. So I'm not gonna attempt liquid. I don't think she has any. Thank God, because liquid eyeliner scares the devil out of me. So we're gonna use this thing because I'm pretty sure it's for your eyeliner or your eyebrows, but I'm sure it'll work for both. So we're just gonna. Yeah, I'm not gonna do what she did because she's got this pretty swoosh thing happening on the wiki how to. That's not gonna happen on my eyes. It's not. But we'll, uh. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. That's, uh, terrible. That's a terrible, chunky, uneven line. At least you're not pulling your eye. That's the right thing to do. <laughs> yeah, I'm not pulling my eye. That's for sure. <laughs> I like how there's chunks of unblended makeup under my eye that I'm noticing right now. It's pretty sexy fix. Um, sure. Well, it's gonna be a dark eye, right? So we'll go with that. Mm-hmm. You probably hear our wonderful children. And that's why we're hiding in the bathroom on Mother's Day. <laughs> um, right, we'll, we'll go with that. Well, I mean, it's not terrible. Is it terrible? No. What do you think, Internet? Is it terrible? Um, did you see the, like, non-blended, chunky, like, <laughs> foundation right here? Because that's the best part. All right, top of your eye. I'm not going around my tear ducts. Suck it. It's not happening. Mascara. I feel like there's more that I should be doing. Like, I think, aren't you supposed to, like, go, like, under your... We'll not use the super dark color. We'll use the light color. But aren't you supposed to go, like, under here with your shit? Like, that's, that's making it much better, actually. Not at all. This is why I don't do makeup well, because I don't follow directions well. And we're gonna go under here a little bit. Sure, I don't know. Okay, um, brush away excess color. That's what she said. I'm not putting mascara on. The last time I put mascara on, I stabbed myself in the eye three times, so I don't wanna have that experience again. Um, brush away excess color. Why isn't there more steps? Oh no, that's a new smoky eye. That's a different smoky eye. I mean, it's not terrible. I don't understand the, the contouring. I don't feel like it made much of a difference at all. It's probably because I didn't do it right, but I mean, I have a little bit of cheekbone-ness <laughs> going on. That's about it. I mean, what do you think? Was it terrible? Mm, no, probably it was bad. But I'm not doing this shit every day. This took a long time. This is, this is unacceptable. <laughs> Way too proud. long time. Um, I don't need to do anything to my brows. <laughs> My brows are perfect the way my brows are. Um, yeah, they probably need to be plucked a little, but I like the nice full brow. Thank you very much. Um, yeah, we're gonna call this a look, so. Am I sexy? Am I, am I beautiful? <laughs> well, I hope you like this video, cause yeah, it was fantastical. Leave a thumbs up if you liked it. Uh, subscribe, we're gonna try to make at least two to three videos every week. And um, we will probably do less of me because Beautiful, too beautiful for the internet, and uh, more of my boys eating weird things. But if you like this and you want me to try another beauty look, um, I guess I could do that for you if you hit the subscribe button. Thanks, love you, bye.